Are you awake? Well, I can't hear anyone walking about. I said I can't hear anyone walking about. Well, I can only hear one of you. Come on, get a move on. Are you out of bed yet? Is Sooty awake? Well, go and wake him up. table. And anyway, you two are late for breakfast, and if I don't get a move on, I'm going to be late for work as well. Mr. Slate has given me a very important job today. Mm. Huh? What job? Ah, today I'm the beach warden, which means I'm in charge of everything that happens on the beach. Oh, we could help you with that, couldn't we, boys? <laughs> well, I'm not sure. You won't be any trouble. Well, no, I'm sorry, but this is a very responsible grown-up's job, which is why Mr. Slater's picked me to do it. <laughs> right, I must go. Have a lovely day. Bye-bye. Oh, I'd have loved a day on the beach. What's that, Sooty? Why don't we go and have fun on the beach anyway? Yes. Come on, boys. Let's get packing. Here we are, open for business. <sighs> Perfect. You know, sometimes I amaze myself. Mm. <sighs> Don't bite me, boy. Hello, Sidney. What a beautiful day! Let's sunbathe. Yes, Sooty? We should rent some sun lounges from that hut over there. Oh, good idea. Come on, then. Hello, service. Hello, good morning. What can I... Morning, Richard. What a glorious day. And what are you lot doing here? You thought you'd come and have some fun on the beach? Oh, did you? Well, as long as you don't get up to any tricks, or I'll be in trouble with Mr. Slater. Oh, go on, Richard. You won't even know we're here. You'll be as good as gold. Oh, all right then. What do you want, Sooty? Can you hire a sun lounger? <laughs> go on, then. <laughs> No, boys, don't take the bottom lounger, take the top lounger. Richard's been lounging about. <laughs> Can you have your ball back, please? Oh, it's your ball, is it? Well, just be careful. Can you have your ball back, please? Well, I'm afraid, boys, on this occasion, the answer is no. Yes, no. 
I am running this beach for Mr Slater and this ball is confiscated. <laughs> yes, confiscated. <laughs> You'll have to do something else. Go and play on the bouncy castle. Go on. <laughs> You fancy an ice cream? That should cool us down. <laughs> then we can do some more bouncing. Ice creams are they? Yes. Surprise, surprise. Well, I'm sorry, but I am running this beach and these ice creams are confiscated. <laughs> yes, confiscated. <laughs> What's that litwit thing he's doing? <laughs> Thank you, Suzy. Sorry about our friend Richard. He's in there, covered in ice cream. I think he's just cooling off. <laughs> what did you say, Suey? How's my sculpture coming on? Very well, thank you. Why don't you come and have a look? Cool. This is a great sand sculpture, isn't it, boy? Yes, if I can get a chance to finish it, if Richard has stopped chucking ice cream at me. <laughs> You'd like to build a sand sculpture? Oh, that's a fantastic idea. I think Richard's got some buckets and spades at the beach hut. Let's go and ask him. Oh, it's you lot, is it? Hmm. Hey, I hope that man's not too angry with me. What do you want, anyway? Buckets and spades? You're going to build a sand sculpture? <laughs> You've got no chance. And anyway, we all know that I am the sand sculpture expert around here. Rubbish. What do you want, Sooty? Prove it. Uh, well, uh, I'd love to, but I'm running the beach and I'll get in trouble with Mr Slater. Don't be silly. Mr Slater would be very pleased. I mean, if you built an amazing sand sculpture for everyone to see... Come on, Mr Expert. Let's see what you can do. Uh, all right, you're on. <laughs> Let's see who can build the best sand sculpture. Hooray! Hey, come on, boys. Let's do it. Perfect. You know what I mean? You think that's funny, do you, Sooty? Ah, <laughs> well, if it's a water fight you want, then game on, get some of this! <laughs> Who's running this beach? Me! <laughs> what I call running the beach. Bye-bye, <laughs> everybody. Bye-bye. <laughs> Why, looky here, me hearties. Well, it bain't be Captain Sooty of the Seven Seas patrolling the waves at night, protecting us all from the dark forces that reside in Davy Jones's locker. But a 
ours there. What be this that the captain spies? Why, it be pirates, and the most fearsome pirate of all, the dreaded Captain Blackbeard. <laughs> Prepare to be boarded, he cried. <laughs> captain Sooty stands firm. I will squirt you with my water pistol, our hero states. <laughs> no, you won't, said Blackbeard. Then it was as if the very forces of nature were unleashed. Is this the end for Captain Sooty? Prepare for the worst, the scurvy knave cried. Prepare for the worst, he cried again. Prepare for the worst, prepare for the worst, prepare for the worst, prepare for the worst, worst. Toast, 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 Sooty? Do you want any toast, Sooty? Oh dear, what is the matter? You've been dreaming about pirates again. Oh, Blackbeard Sweep was about to take over your ship. Oh, the scoundrel. Oh, I thought you were going to squirt me. <laughs> what did he do that for? He did that because he's been dreaming of pirates again. Ha ha! Ha ha! <laughs> Boys! Ah, morning all. Now, I'm not quite sure what job I'll be doing today because... Ah! <laughs> what are you doing? Playing pirates? Ah! <laughs> Do I want to play? Uh, oh. Yes. No, I didn't mean yes, bone brain. Oh, Mr. Slater. No, no, you're not a bone brain. What's that? Will I uh, do your boating leg for you? Well, I'd certainly like that. <laughs> yes, I know it's wet work, Mr. Slater. But I'm not... yeah, yes, I'd certainly do that. It's, it's... Oh, he's gone. Look, what's got into you two? <laughs> I do not want to play pirates, OK? Now go and play somewhere else. Oh, I've got to get to work. Hello there. Mr. Slater's squirty boats are certainly very, very busy today. Thanks for bringing my raincoat, Sue. That'll certainly come in handy if I get squirted again. Well, you do look a bit of a drip, Richard. <laughs> Gang, hey, what's all this about? You want to play pirates in your old toy boat? Oh dear, it could do with a lick of paint and sails. Yes, I know, it doesn't look very seaworthy, does it? You know, it's very dangerous to get into a boat that looks like it might sink. You've got to clean it up and make it ship shape. <laughs> oh, well done, Sooty. That's the spirit. This boat for fix the leaks and make it float. We we'll sail like pirates on the sea with our bravest captain, Sooty. La 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 la
Oh, I see you're working very hard, sweet. And how are you getting on with the painting, Sooty? He's obviously very busy. Sooty! I'll see you. Sooty! Oh, dear. I don't think Sooty's going to be very pleased with me. Oh, dear. Oh, Sooty, I'm so sorry. Let me wipe you down. Come here, little fella. Oh, dear. You know, you're taking this pirate thing really seriously, you know. Next thing, you'll be telling me that you've got a treasure map and a telescope. <laughs> he has. Oh, I see. Go on, then, where's your treasure map? Oh, let's have a look at it. A real treasure map. <laughs> Hang on a minute. This isn't a treasure map. This is your comic. Oh, I see. You want me to try the telescope, do you? All right, then. Here we go. Wow! You can see for miles with this thing. I ought to go and see what Sue's doing. Oh, good idea. Oh, hello, Sue. Hello, Richard. Oh, have you been fighting? No. So what are you doing? I'm just making the sail for Sooty's boat. Oh, that's wonderful. Well, can I help you? Oh, yes. Could you hold the material straight for me while I cut it, please? Certainly, Sue. That would be a pleasure. Oh. You see, Sue is very sensible. She waited for a grown-up to be here before she started using her scissors. She's such a clever little panda. Oh, thank you, Richard. Oh, I think I got a little bit carried away. <laughs> oh, hello, sweet. <laughs> have I been fighting? No, I have not been fighting. I've made your sails for the boat, Sooty. Let's put them up. Come on. Can I help you fix that hole? Well, of course I can. What do you want me to do? Hold the glue. All right. OK. Oh, careful. <laughs> yeah, I've got it. Go on. Oh, well, that's, I'd say that's more than fixed it, Sweep. Sweep, be, be careful with a brush. Oh. Sweep! Get. Sweep! Get! 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 Oh. Get. Go on, get it off! Go on. Oh. Oh. Ow! Cool. Oh! Customers! The sails are brilliant. Thank you. But I don't know where you're going to find any pirates to fight on a boating lake. What? Let's set sail right now and look for some. Well, how are we going to get our boat onto the water? <gasps> Izzy! Izzy, Wizzy, let's get busy! Slice the main brace! Not that fast, sweet! Oh, you bone brain! What's happened to our sail? A pirate? There is a pirate off the starboard bow. Both and sweep. Prepare the cannon. Fire! He's getting away. Quick, call for backup, Sooty. There was a pirate to fight. <laughs> bye bye, Richard. Oh, bye bye, everybody. Bye bye. Oh, hello. There. So clean you can see your face in it. Oh, hello. Do you like our cup? It's the prize for the sports day competitions this afternoon. 
What was that, Sue? Oh, hello. I was just telling the boys and girls about the sports day. Oh, yes. Mr Slater's put me in charge this year. Oh. Oh, it's Mr Slater. Hello, Mr Slater. Yes, everything's here. Nothing will go wrong. If it does, I can have the sack. <laughs> I don't need a sack. I've already got one. <laughs> you mean I'll get the sack? Oh, uh, oh, he's gone. Oh, dear. Hope everything goes well. Mm. Where are Sooty and Sweep? Oh, I think they're warming up at the gym. Oh. Sooty, I just thought I'd come and see how you were getting on. Where's Sweep? He just took off. Oh, that's a shame. So are you all ready for the competitions? You're going to win Easy Peasy Lemon Squeezy. <laughs> all right, Smarty Bunch. Come on, then, let's see your muscles. Uh... <laughs> Come on, then, the other one. <laughs> Sooty, they're like peas in a pod. <laughs> what? You're going to get them really big with the chest expanders? Ooh, go on, then. Sooty, show us how it's done. Come on. Are you sure you can do this? Go on, have another go. Come on. Oh, Sooty, this is very difficult. This time, put all your effort into it. Come on, really let rip. Come on, come on. Brilliant, Sooty. Brilliant. One, two, one, two. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Slater Sports Day. Over to you, Sue. Thank you, Richard. That's right, boys and girls. Slater Sports Day is the sporting event of the year. Over to you, Richard. Thank you, Sue. Our expert athletes are now warming up for the first competition, which is called... Over to you, Sue. This is no yoke. It's the egg and spoon race. Over to you, Richard. Thank you, Sue. Sack for you. Thank you. Here's one for you. Thank you. Good girl. Here's one for Thank you. Thank you. And here's one for you. Thank you. And one each for Sooty and Sweep. There you go. Yes. How'd you do a sack race? <laughs> oh, it's easy. In fact, you're talking to a sack race expert, actually. What? Show you. Well, all right. Then look, it's simple. You just get both feet and put them right inside the sack like this. Very important to pull the sack right up so you're right inside it. Just like this, you see? What? Hey, it's all gone dark. Where's the door? Take your places. Hello? Get set. Go! What's going on? Let me out. I can't see where I'm going. Shutty! Oh. And up, C9 contestants, we have taken the lead. This is incredible. Richard has well and truly got the sack! Oh, uh, 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 hello? Yes, Mrs. 
Slater? Yes, everything's going very well. Bye bye. Help! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Richard, your sack must have somehow tied itself into a knot. Don't understand this, Sue. It's never done that before. Well, actually, Sooty did it. It was very silly of him. You could have hurt yourself. Uh, excuse me. Boys and girls, it's time for the event you've all been waiting for. The grand final of Slater's Sports Day. The Long Jump. Will the two finalists take their places in the jump? Now, boys, before we can start the final competition, here are the rules. Now, we need two markers for this. The first marker is where you start the jump, and we'll put the second marker down where you finish the jump. Then we'll measure the distance between the two, and whoever's jumped the furthest will be the winner! <laughs> right, who's going to jump first? You both can't jump at the same time, can you? We'll let Sooty go first, because he won the first race! Off you go, Sooty. Right, let's measure it. We could have a record on our hands there. That was definitely the landing point. Here we go then, Sooty. Let's see. We've got... Wow, it's 60 centimetres! And a record jump from Sooty there! Yes? Your turn now. Oh, all right then. You're an expert. Oh, he's an expert, ladies and gentlemen. OK, sweet. Your turn. Sure, you're an expert. <laughs> okay. Well, let's measure it anyway. You can help measure it if you want. Let's put the marker in first. That's where you landed, wasn't it? Okay. You can hold the tape measure. <laughs> Go on up. Put it at the starting thing. I don't think we're in for any record breaking today. Let's measure it, Sooty. Wow! It's 80 centimeters. 80 cent. <laughs> hey, sausage brain. Let go of it. Go on. <laughs> Come here. He's going to have to go, that dog. Move out of the way. Come on, let's measure it properly. Let's have a look. <laughs> it's 16 centimetres! Yes? Can you have another go? I don't, should we give him one more go, everybody? Yeah. Yes? All right, then one more go. But this time, sweet, take a really good run at it. You got it? A run. Yeah, well, go on, whenever you're ready, then. Really good run. Sooty, dig him out. <laughs> Welcome back, Sweet. That was pretty good. Right. Yes, we'll measure it. We'll measure it. I know it's there. I got it. Right. Okay. Here we go, then, everybody. Let's find out what it was, and we've got uh, <gasps> sixty centimeters, which means it's a draw. <laughs> Thank you, Sue. Yes, come on, boys, take a bow! <laughs> oh dear, it looks like Richard's making a prize fool of himself! Bye-bye, <laughs> everybody. Bye-bye. <laughs>